We present OSO, an inference tool learned from real data to predict the skeleton inside a body shape. Human motion capture has many applications in medicine, sports, science, and biomechanics. These applications typically require knowledge of the bones and how they move. With paired observations of the body's surface and the internal skeleton, we could learn a mapping from the body shape to the skeleton, but no such data exists. With OSO, we make a step to address this problem. Our insight is to use DEXA scans. A DEXA scan is a pair of 2D images, one showing the external body and the other showing the skeleton. We align a body and a skeleton model to those images and thus build a data set of paired body and skeleton meshes to learn to predict the inside from the outside. For each DEXA scan pair, we first align the body model star to the body silhouette to get a body mesh. Then we align a skeleton model to the skeleton silhouette to get a skeleton mesh. Those alignments constitute a data set of paired body and skeleton meshes that we use to learn a mapping from the body to the bones. From that data, we learn, for each gender, a PCA model of the skeleton. The correlation between the body shape and the skeleton shape and the correlation between the body shape and the bones location. At inference time, given an unseen body shape, we predict the skeleton shape and bone landmarks, then optimize the skeleton to fit those. Finally, we can repose the skeleton to a target pose. We evaluate the inferred skeleton shape on the left out DEXA scans. Given a DEXA skin image, we align star, infer the skeleton, and compare it to the ground truth DEXA. We show that we outperform our baseline, anatomy transfer. We show inference results for clothed subjects from render people. Those are part of the Agora dataset, which include high quality simple fits to the scans. We fit star to simple and then apply OSO to estimate the pose skeleton. We presented OSO, the first inference tool that can generate a skeleton from any body shape and is validated on medical data. The inference code is available on GitHub. Please visit the project webpage for more details.